So you want to know if you can rent a buy-to-let property to a family member. If that's the case, then let's go. My name's Dan, welcome to another video. If it's your first time here and you're interested in hearing about all things UK buy-to-let property related, make sure you start now by subscribing and clicking the bell to ensure that you don't miss a thing. So can you let a standard buy-to-let property to a family member or close family member? The answer is yes, if the property is paid off and you don't have a mortgage product on the property. The answer is also yes, if you have a mortgage product that allows you to rent to family members. But the answer is no, if you just have a standard buy-to-let mortgage product. Family members are not typically allowed to be tenants under the terms and conditions of most standard buy-to-let mortgage products. So who classes as a family member? Parents, siblings, grandchildren, grandparents, a spouse, and a civil partner. And the main reason for most buy-to-let lenders not allowing investors to let to family members is because the Financial Conduct Authority, so the FCA, would have to be far more involved in the affordability assessment whilst regulating the mortgage application process. So this requires more work from the lender. So most only provide a standard unregulated buy-to-let mortgage product. Now, the consequences of not telling your lender that a family member is going to be your tenant could be severe. You would, in effect, be committing mortgage fraud. So, therefore, your lender could actually demand the full repayment of that loan as soon as they found out. You might be able to get permission from your lender, but you'd have to give them a call and explain the situation. It is though possible, and whilst most lenders don't offer mortgage products allowing you to let to close family members, there are a select few that do. At the time of recording this video, so December 2020, there are a few lenders out there at the moment who are offering these regulated family let products. They are Bluestone, Furness, Mansfield, Melton Mowbray and Newbury. If you did want to rent to a family member and you've already got a mortgage product, but yet your mortgage lender isn't one of the ones that actually provide these regulated products and they don't have the flexibility, really the only option you have is to switch lenders to completely avoid that risk of having to pay back the entire amount of the loan. But what about extended family? So cousins, uncles, aunts, nieces, and nephews, they don't actually class as family members. So if you want you le- wanted to let your property to these relations or other extended family members, then there would be no issue at all and you wouldn't actually be in breach of the terms and conditions of your loan. If you do rent to family members, it's really important to remember that you shouldn't be setting it up on a casual or an informal basis because it certainly won't be seen as this in the eyes of the law. You still have your obligations as a landlord and of course tax to consider as well. You'll still need to take your obligations as a landlord seriously even in a scenario where you're letting to somebody that you already know really well. I really hope you've enjoyed this video. If you have, make sure you give me a like below and drop me a comment just to say hi.